guys, how's it going? My name is Alex and welcome back everybody to the Minecraft Survival Let's Play. Now, I know it's been a little bit guys uh, for the uploads. I'm still working on getting you guys more daily uploads to the best of my ability. Uh, but without further ado guys, I want to thank you guys for all the support on the last episode of the Minecraft Survival Let's Play. Um, it was awesome to see how much you guys, you know, continue to like the series. And I have some cool plans. You know, I've been watching other people's Survival Let's Plays and kind of getting ideas for myself and, and how we can, you know, enhance this uh, Let's Play and just really make it fun um on the first thing i want to say before we get started is if you guys can all hit that like button that'd be absolutely amazing um and if we can do that basically i will work my butt off to try to get you a crafting dead episode on a server and then from there on we'll see what else we're gonna do um i also want to ask you guys in the comment sections what other type of builds we should do around here in this world because um pretty much we have a lot of areas to explore uh for the same reason that over here there's actually a snow biome down there and i kind of want to go with the idea of using theme so in the snow biome I'm thinking you know when it gets colder like maybe not during fall but like at the end of the season fall or we could even work on it it doesn't really matter but my idea was that we can actually go build ourselves like a little you know vacation house in the winter area you know, in the winter biome so I thought that'd be pretty cool uh, I'd like to know from what you guys think about that I think it'd be pretty interesting just to see you know like a snow cabin over there like some type of little warm cabin you know kind of like make a trail going through there or whatever because we do have cool biomes around here and I think it'll be pretty unique as well. Um, so yeah, let's get started guys. I don't have much to do in today's episode because I kind of like just got back at it, but I want to show you guys work that I did off screen and that's actually really important. Also, for some reason, um, all my inventory items were gone when I got back on and I think that has to do with uh, me opening up a different, like I, I was running this on 1.8.4 and for some reason my Minecraft opened it in 1.7.4 and I think it just messed up everything. So these are all items I just put back in um, that I basically lost. I actually put less items than I had, um, even for this inventory stuff like diamond pickaxe. Like I don't even enchant them yet. Like I just grabbed whatever I could from the um, creative because I just kind of wanted to stick with whatever we had. Um, and you know, I probably got less than I should have too, but it doesn't matter. We'll get it all back It's all about the journey. Also, I am working on revamping the thumbnails for this series Let me know what you guys think about it as well in the comment sections So let me show you guys around because we were here anyway, so basically this is gonna be the portal room um, All I did was pretty much just build uh, a larger portal and just cover it down and enter it uh, What is this stone? I forgot andersite. I think it's andersite if I'm not mistaken. Where is the andersite? Oh Yep, andersite, polished, no wait, polished dorite? Yeah, dorite, there we go, so I was, it was dorite, so I was wrong. So yeah, that's pretty much what I did, and I don't know why my frames keep dropping for some weird reason. It drops here and there, which is really bugging me, so I'll fix that eventually. Also, why is this, there we go, alright, we're just fixing things left and right here. Um, also back here, there are mobs, like, uh, there's a few actually. They usually just spawn here because it's dark, so I thought it'd be pretty cool. Basically, it is like a mini spawner, but just to the fact that it's like nothing here, just they spawn randomly. So uh, that's pretty cool. You know, I kind of just did that for the show of it. Um, and up here, there isn't much except for this little gap here. And again, I lost a lot of items, so I just put in back whatever we had. And this is like pretty much standard for what we had. Um, I didn't really take anything extra. It's pretty much what we had and whatever I lost, I kind of just put back whatever I thought you know, we lost. Even if I forgot some things, it's fine. If you guys remember, I could easily look back at the other videos and go from there. Also, I did work on the pathways. These are brand new as well for you guys. Let me know what you guys think about these pathways. Uh, it's gonna be the theme. I kind of want to go with something like rustic themed wise. I think it would be pretty cool. Also, I did finish the side of these walls. I kind of added a little design to it um, to kind of give it, you know, a really cool, unique look. And it really looks cool from, you know, further away. It just really has a cool look to it. And I just really like how it came out. And also for for the horse and everything I did add some hay bills uh, with whatever wheat I had left and pretty much that was it and you know what I want to use the horse a bit more since we are here uh, so I can show you guys around a bit faster so as you can see the house is still the same nothing different um, other than that over here there is a big difference we have ourselves uh, pretty much a bridge but this bridge is kind of like enclosed but it's also not oh no horse you got this all right there we go it's pretty much like this um, it's difficult to show the design but you know it's a really unique looking design. You got like a, here, I'll just go through the middle to show you guys. Like over here we have an opening. Oh gosh, okay, we have to go like right through the middle. And we have a little like skyline over there. And it pretty much brings us to the farm. I know a lot of you guys were leaving comments in the comment sections about this farm and how it's pretty much like an old style. I agree 100% with you guys. Um, this was just because I wanted to get something quickly done and kind of have 
uh, a simple farm where I could just get the crops I need and not just like bug out because I really don't need that many crops to be honest with you guys I don't need as much um, most likely I'm going to be fixing it um, we could do it now but I don't think it's the need to do it right now I could easily do it off screen uh, but again I am going to be working on building like an actual farm for animals because we do need to get other types of food resources and things also we do have areas around here where there can be other types of inspirations for buildings um, you know there's a lot of cool areas around here to build like even these tall mountains and things of that nature so you guys let me know again what you guys think about this design how it looks I think it's you know turning out really awesome and I, I just really like it a lot um, I also just want to show you guys the snow biome because I kind of want to go map out an area that we can use for pretty much the uh, snow cabin that I'm thinking about uh, so you know let's see what we can take I think I just take some wood for now um, and then really that's kind of it I don't have anything else in plan to what to take with me but I just want to show you guys around because this episode I don't have anything really planned out like I, I wanted to get something planned out but I didn't know what to do because I lost so many items and I pretty much just wanted to see what this world has to offer for us because I did check out some areas around here and I gotta be honest it's a really cool like area and I know a lot of you guys wanted the seed so you know I'll probably release that you know once we get to like some type of milestone like 50 episodes in um, so something like that um, so with that being said I want to like get some type of buildings around here as well you know kind of work with different biomes but the snow biome is definitely my like number one like I want to build in it so badly because I haven't really ever been in a snow biome like and actually built in it in a series if that makes any sense for you guys so this is something that it's like a must and it just looks so beautiful like I don't know how to explain this it looks really freaking awesome um, so I think it's just absolutely perfect for just like an area for snow biomes, especially when you got like trees, forests all around here. Um, it, it'll definitely work out pretty awesome, um, when we get to, you know, the bottom of it and actually build our lounge. Also send me some ideas for that. Cause I could get inspired early on and pretty much like, you know, maybe start doing some planning on how to build this, uh, cabin. So yeah, I mean, look at this. It's like a frozen lake. Everything is a snow biome. It's absolutely beautiful. So, uh, you know, you guys let me know in the comment sections, you know, give me all this info. But yeah, there's a lot of areas that we can do buildings around here. So I don't really have a specific area for us at the moment. So we're just going to walk back, you know, just showing you guys around with the world. I haven't done that much. Like I know previous episodes, we pretty much just like kind of like did some buildings and things of that nature. But like, I just wanted to go and like, explore a bit because i feel like it's it's like the easiest thing to do right now with all the items being missed we could do some enchants actually yeah let's go finish up some enchants oh i don't want to fall in there because i do have some like weapons that need to be enchanted oh we have cows here we should actually oh wait no i need these cows hold up um uh, if only i had a fence all right we'll do that another time because i want to use cows for my main source of food it's like the best saturation in my opinion at the moment so that's pretty much what we'll use but yeah, guys, this location is absolutely superb. We got pigs. We got everything. Everything we possibly need. And this horse is just absolutely amazing. It can actually swim and think, what is down there? We should actually check that out when we have the opportunity because we can make that our mine if we wanted to because we don't have a mine either. And I also have some areas that are going to be planned out for designing down here. I'm going to put your horse back in because... Uh, like, we've been, like, on... Like, he needs a break. He just needs a break. That's all I got to say. Um... So down here, I do want to add more to it, of course. Like, I don't want it just to be sideways. I actually want to build a staircase going down and pretty much like opening up in a big circle and kind of having other areas to explore and kind of really make specific rooms where it could be really cool. Oh, wait a minute. We don't have an enchantment table or books anymore because of the uh, stupid Minecraft. Like, it just, like, deleted all my items. So... Oh, that's an issue. See, that's why this episode was pretty much me just exploring and trying to see if you guys are okay. You know what? I think it's only fair to go back in creative and pretty much grab the enchantment and the books because we did have them and I have it on recording for proof. So let's actually do that. Let's do game mode uh, C and let's actually grab ourselves the enchantment table and we're going to grab ourselves. Uh, let's see. Let's just put that there and then we're just going to get some books. So we need the books because I don't know. We had like around... I would say like 12 like I don't want to take too many but like 13 was about how many we had um, and we'll pretty much do that game mode uh, game mode survival and I don't really have an area for the enchants but for now because I do have an open space for it 
uh, we are gonna go and just pluck it over here and it's pretty even so you know this could be an enchantment room just because it's like right here and it, and it actually works out pretty well if anything so uh, that's what we might do keep it like this and see what enchants we get maybe we're lucky and we'll get like quality enchants oh did I really mess this up right now all right I don't have any silk touch so that's gonna break off oh, fantastic uh, but we have I think enough to go I think this is pretty good you know let's just see what we can get on our uh, diamond sword we don't even have lapis, and I had so much lap. Oh wait, no, we do have lapis because I did actually bring back whatever uh, valuable items I had. I'm pretty sure I still have I do not have lapis. All right, guys, see this is what I mean. I wish Minecraft did not do this, and trust me, I did not delete any items. I did not put any items that were not supposed to be in here, anything like that. I pretty much followed my rules, and I did not do anything that's like can disrupt the game by any chance. So uh, I'm 100% true with you guys. So don't go like you know all mad in the comment section. It's always using creative to grab things. These are things that I lost and I had already. So I just want to express that so you guys understand. Um, so here we go. Let's see. Um, okay, that is really ugly. That is not good whatsoever. Uh, let's go with a pickaxe and see what we can get from that one. Uh, efficiency. Oh, wait. Do we need more of these? Okay, there we go. Efficiency one. Uh, we don't have 22, which could have been unbreaking three. I can easily accept efficiency one for a diamond pickaxe because I can easily, you know, always fix that unless I can get something from an iron. Efficiency one. Uh, was it efficiency two? No, it's still one. Oh, that's ugly. That is really ugly. Let's see um, if we just what happens if we add just one more bookcase just for the just for the sake of it. I don't think it's gonna do anything really, but um, it shouldn't. But oh, look at that! It did efficiency two. That's pretty cool. All right, we're gonna go with efficiency two on this. All right, there we go. Let's get our sword in here. Smite. Oh, sharpness one and smite two. Smite two is garbage. I think we can go for a sharpness one on this if we really wanted to. Uh, what can we get on a shovel? I mean, we could just go for the sh sharp, this one. I mean, it's not bad because you get like, a, I think it's like an eight. Let's see. It's like an 8.25. All right, we'll take it because it's better than what we have right now. Um, we do have some more diamonds. Let's make some armor. Let's do, let's just make an enchantment. This is going to be like enchantment time, you know, because we're pretty much close to the end of the episode. We kind of explored, we talked a bit, and we're just going to have some fun with some enchants. I know that these enchants on the diamond armor is going to be complete waste, or we could do some, uh, maybe we should do iron armor for now, just so we can stay safe with things. I don't want to go and just like waste all this diamonds right now, because I know I had about like this many. So right now I'm going to go safe and just make ourselves the iron armor, because I don't want to go and do things with less enchants. I'd rather just take the opportunity, use the iron I have, and pretty much make better enchants in the future. So let's do that now. Let's see. Protection two. Oh, oh, we're we're definitely taking that. Protection two is solid. Uh, you know, for what we have right now. Um, so I'm taking that for sure. Let's go with the pants. What do we got here? What do we got? Fire protection one. All right, these are not bad. Listen, this this is better than like the average for enchants. I would say protection two. I'm taking all of this, guys. This is g gorgeous. If only this lapis could stay in, that'd be amazing. All right, what is this? Unbreaking one. Is that? really all we have left for the for the boots uh let's just i'm breaking one like i don't think it's gonna do anything at all i'd rather not waste that level of enchant but it just looks weird all right we're gonna enchant them why not um whatever let's just enchant it there we go boom we pretty much just got ourselves an enchanted gear i mean the armor level is still you know decent better than what it was with just normal iron i'm pretty sure if i'm not mistaken but yeah i mean guys let's just face it this is better than what we had before um you know we're kind of like still evolving even though we lost so many items which I, it really bothered me because you know we had actually a good amount of items that we could have used and things of that nature so you know i can't do anything about it but it is what it is Let's see what we can get here. Let's just see if we can just enchant any more of these standard items that I need for now. Efficiency two, I'll take it. And then for the, uh, let's see, efficiency two, perfect. I'll take all of this for now because why not? At this point, it's stuff that I'll need, stuff that I'll do, like pretty much use it uh, constantly to get resources again. Cause I'm gonna be doing a lot of that because we lost so much and it really does suck, but it is what it is. I can't really do much about it. Uh, so yeah, there we go. Uh, now for this room, I might design it off screen, but again, this was all temporary, so don't get all caught up with this beautiful design. I know it's gorgeous. I know it looks the best thing ever, 
best room ever in this uh, let's play but we're gonna have some downstairs levels it's gonna open up into a big like oval space with other areas opening up and things like that so guys if you guys enjoyed today's episode make sure you guys hit that like button i know it was a bit slow but please understand that it's going to be exciting because you guys are basically going to contribute to the next episode for ideas in the comment sections. Uh, so yeah, you guys let me know in the comment sections. Um, I do have a lot of crazy plans for the builds and it's going to be exciting. There's a lot of things that's going to go into this Let's Play. So other than that, guys, my name is Alex and stay foxy, guys. If you haven't already subscribed, make sure you do so and hit that like button. I love reading your comments as well. So don't be worried about leaving any comment. I will reply to it with my best ability, guys. Peace out. My name is Alex. Stay foxy.